Ooh, boy. Cerrone, whoa. The, uh, he, Cerrone did something. I don't know if I've... I don't remember the last time he ever went for a takedown. Cerrone. Cerrone took him down. Petra Cote. He took him... Cerrone took Pe Petra Cote down. And Cote managed to get back up. And he took him down again in the same round. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what the hell is going on? And uh, second round, second round, Cerrone and Cote were go going to war. Cote has a damn good chin, but uh, I believe this round he did knock him down. Cerrone knocked Cote down. Yeah. And uh, in the corners, Greg Jackson, the way what he was saying to Cowboy was f funny as hell. Like, oh, this is fun. He's having fun. And Cote's like in the third round, leading up to the third round, Cote goes, this is going to be the best round. This is going to be my best round. All right, let's have some fun. Oof. And Cerrone just unloaded and dropped Cote and then told C Cote to get back up. This was in the third round. And then he <laughs> blasted him again. And Cote went down, and that was it. That was it. Cerrone stopped Cote in the third round. And I said this on Twitter. He, he looked very good. Very good. And Cote, I mean, not Cote, Cerrone always looks good, right? In his fights. But as you guys already know, if you know about this guy, when it's time for the big dance, guys, the big dance, you know, big dance, when he fights the elite of the elite, what happens? You guys know what happens. <laughs> He's not the champion, dudes. He's never been the champion in the UFC. Never, 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 never. But he is very, very good. And I do want to say this. This is very very contrasting styles Cerrone fights extremely often right extremely often you know who doesn't Nate Diaz these two guys have been in the fight game for a long 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 time but their careers are two are in two different directions we got Nate Diaz is who only wants to <laughs> take on big fights okay big fights big money fights <laughs> and he did. He, he took on Conor and he made a boatload of money. On the other hand, you got Cerrone over here who takes so many fights and so many fights and so many fights. He, he makes a lot of money by making by fighting a lot. So I'm I'm just curious who who actually would make more? Who makes more? Do you does the guy who f fight more often make more than the guy who holds out for big money fights and gets them? I don't know. It's a very interesting question. As for Cerrone, who knows? He did say that he kind of wants to fight at UFC 200. He goes at 170, 155. I don't give a shit. I'll fight. And he, yeah, that he, that's how he is. He will fight. 